a man of God once shared a testimony and I shared it here. I listened to him. He said somebody was supposed to take a flight. He missed the flight and the person was angry. He now joined a train and the train crashed. The flight too crashed. You see that these kinds of people have been appointed unto death. Whether it's bike, whether whatever the devil, there are people the devil does not want them to backslide. He wants them to die. That even in their backsliding states, they are too useful to God's program. He wants to get them out of the way. Ah, oh, minus you, Koinonia. I said minus you in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm just showing you that God is mandating the church to rise to a heightened revelation about dominion over unclean spirits. These spirits that stand in the highway, I hope you know that a major part of accidents are caused by spirits. I have prayed for people who were driving. They were not careless. The steering locked. It, they would tell you they were not careless. They were not drunk. They were driving and the next thing, the steering locked. They tried to press the brake. It was not there. You will know that there are spirits. You must die. Hallelujah. With all due respect to medicine, how about doctors that have made costly mistakes on patients' bodies? Some of them were not born again and they were simply medical practitioners. Except that when a spirit arrived at theater, he also contributed in the surgery and manipulated their hands. Something that should be a basis for healing now scattered the patient's body. This is why we need people to be born again, regardless what you do. A business can, man can be on fire. It's one thing to know how to buy and sell. It's one thing to put a mall as big as this auditorium. Then one mysterious fire in the name of one wire sparking burns everything. And you, as intelligent as you are, you actually believe that that fire was a product of a spark. It's a joke. God gave us brains and intents that we use them. Spirits are real. Their effect can be felt in the earth realm. Again, let me pray for you. In the name of Jesus, every spirit assigned to your destiny, to your ministry, to your family, to bring shame and reproach in this end time. We raise a standard by the blood. 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 We raise a